today we'll be going over Summer's hit visit to the hair salon. She did get her very first professional trim and blow dry. So to start, she did go ahead and wash her hair. And she actually did really, really good with the whole wash process. Um, so here she is continually, continuously washing her hair. She did use a shampoo brush for the wash. And she did a light detangle, um, which I didn't get on camera. But for this, it was very easy because we did do our sink wash routine. So this was very similar to our sink wash routine. So she handled this like a pro. Once she was washed and conditioned, she did go back over and do a little bit of detangling. Before we went to the salon, I did lightly detangle her hair, and her hair was in a protective twist style, so her hair wasn't really tangled at all. So after she detangled the hair, she did remove some of the shed hair, and she went in and blew dry her hair with a comb attachment. She said because she was so young, she wanted to blow dry it this way, and she usually uses a brush when she blow dried it, but this time she did use a comb. And I did bring along some snacks and her phone to keep her busy during this part. We have blow dried at home. She did, that did hurt her a little bit. Um, we have blow dried at home, um, but I never really got it this sleek, which is another reason why I wanted to take her to a hair salon. Um, she does do my hair as well, and the setting that she uses, it's never hot for whatever reason. It never feels hot. I'm not sure which setting she uses, um, but it's a pretty comfortable setting. And she wanted to get under the hair, so she just had her bend down and get underneath her hair. And when I tell you someone was so excited to get her hair done, she talked about it for days. So here we are out of our blow dry, and as you can see, she really likes her results. She says she looked like Rapunzel. And she's just going through her hair to see if there's any tangles and to see about how much she's going to trim. So here she is trimming her hair and the reason why I went for a professional trim this time around is because um, like I said she trims my hair and I just feel like she's a professional and she can do a way better job than I can. So if you do have kids I do encourage you if it's in your budget to go ahead and get their hair trimmed by a professional rather than doing it themselves. I know I make great YouTube videos, but there's just some things that I prefer to leave to a professional. Um, so this is something that I will begin to incorporate into her regimen every six months. And this is the only time she will be getting heat on her hair is when she's getting a trim. So some of the feedback that she did give me is she said usually when um, toddlers or kids come for their first trim, you usually have to cut off about an inch or more of hair. But since she's had a couple of trims that I've done and a lot of protective hairstyles, um, she didn't really cut too much hair. She called, cut about a quarter of an inch and I could definitely see the difference when I ran my fingers through her hair um, of how well of a trim she got. So now she's just styling her hair and for this first style we were going to do a corn roll with a top knot bun. But when I tell y'all she was not feeling this braid in this hairstyle, she was not feeling it at all. Huh? You wanna like, well, we gotta take something out of your face, okay? So you want a, a ponytail like this and you want it to come down? You don't want a ponytail? What, what do you want? Okay, so just, can I just put a bobby pin here? One bobby pin, so I can just stay, and then we'll leave. You the want it like that? Out, down, you want okay. it down like this? Here, you can hold that. I won't put it in your She's hair. not gonna put it in, okay? As you can see, she was really excited having it pinned down with a bobby pin, and she is so in love with her hair. So I will let her wear it down for about a week, and we are back 
to protective hairstyling. Um, so I hope you guys found this video helpful. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on letting your child get their hair done at a salon, whether it's a blow dry trim, and how do you feel about those things. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, thumbs up. Make sure you keep up with Summer on her Instagram, as well as um, my social networks.